boss? What is it, Crispin? What's going on? We're looking for Metromind. No, I mean, what's going on with the world? Everything is falling apart. Everyone we meet is crazy, corrupt, or just evil. If man was such a perfect robot, why did he build such a terrible world? <sighs> the world man built was perfect, Crispin. A perfect machine made up of a million imperfect parts. Us. As long as we performed our functions, the machine ran smoothly. But some robots wanted to do less than their functions. Some robots wanted to take more than they deserved. And some wanted to rebuild the machine entirely, to command others. Now everything is misaligned and jammed and spinning out of control. Can you fix it, Horatio? I can't even fix the unique. This world won't be saved until man returns and formats it afresh. But, as long as we still have a charge, we have to keep patching things as best we can. And maybe squash some bugs along the way? Some big ones. <laughs> Metaphor! It's not what it seems. Oh, well that worked then. Cool. It's not even scorched. What? We're going to need something much stronger. Much stronger than that? Um, it's too bad I don't have another bomb light or something. I suppose I could oil it open. That's never going to be. Yeah, I didn't think so. So what can I do here? Because the cables... Well, I'll try cutting cables, I guess. Because why not? Eh. Try to suck the cable. Crispin, stand back. I'm going to cut this cable. Why? Uh, you aren't going to make me push it over the edge like the last one, are you? No. But why even bother? Maybe it will shut down the door's lock. Oh. Yeah. Well. Decent guess, then. Yes. Still locked. Oh, well, worth a try. Still gonna be useful for something now. The current is exposed and waiting. Hey, boss, can you use the cable to melt the door down? No, that won't work. Hey, boss. No, that won't. Um, well, what if I use this to make it more intense or something? Oh. No. Can't use it on it? No? You sure? Okay. Hey, boss, can you use the cape? No, that won't. Well, what will work? Hey, look, we were missing something. It's pinned under the rubble. Should have known. It's Scraper's arm. Looks like it was pinned under the rubble. Well, let's dig it on out then. I nice. The arm loose. Okay. Probably power that with the electric cable or whatever. Alright. Well, I maybe I should have known since I did notice that Scraper was missing an arm, but I didn't assume that it would be important. <laughs> My mistake. Let's continue on then. Yep, just gotta move back into the station here. Nothing more to do with it. Oh, right, it's already open. Of course. Maybe we can use his laser arms to cut through the big old door, maybe? That'd be nice. Stop staring, gosh. It's creepy. Okay, I can pop down a save just in case something happens. Gosh, so many saves. Hey, boss, can you... No, no. Well, I will, kind of. Just not directly. Maybe. Now, there we go. Christmas Sweet. Stand back. I'm going to try firing Scraper's gun using the cable as a power source. Stand back. <laughs> okay, I'm not sure how I'm controlling it, but all right. <laughs> wow. That's, uh, pretty hot. Let's go. Sure convenient that it stopped when you wanted it to. Oh, it's Metromind. Is this? It's Metromind's core. All we need to do is destroy that mainframe. <laughs> uh, boss? I thought you wanted to destroy the mainframe. Um... 
Oh, he wants to get her attention? You have my attention, Horatio Nullbilt. Gotcha. Do you still insist on going by that name? Pay whatever attention you like, you rusting switchboard. I'm not here to talk. I'm here to destroy you. <laughs> ah, well, I am not surprised. After all, you were built to destroy Metropole. Don't waste your last cycle spitting lies. I suggest you think about your victims. Is that why you call yourself Horatio? So that you can preach to me about victims. You, the Urbanian super weapon, named for the human's god of death. I thought so. What are you talking about? Oh, come now, Horace. You've unlocked every other door, decrypted every other code, found every other hidden bit and bite. Do you really expect me to believe that you haven't solved your own puzzle? Boss, what's she talking about? Lies. It ends now, Metromind. Your game is over. Indeed. Four megacycles will now be redeemed. Uh. Did you really think you could outsmart me? I have more parallel processors than you have transistors. And now it's time for me to add another processor. Yours. Boss. Cycles. Step out of it, boss. Memory. No. Don't embarrass yourself. You are no one. And how would you possibly stop me? You don't even have arms. I'm not no one. I am Crispin Horatio, built version one. I have free will and a maglev unit. And I am a floating bomb. Crispin. Crispin. Oh. What's this? It looks like Crispin's personality matrix survived the explosion. Oh. That means we can he's still alive, kind of, right? My friend, if I make it back alive, I promise I'll find a way to rebuild you. What's this? It's a storage ship with a data port on it. It must have been blasted out of Metromind. Hmm. Take it. Poor Crispin, but as far as I'm concerned, he's not dead. Okay, he's not dead. Um, he's just sleeping, basically. He, we'll just make him a new body, he'll be fine. Okay? I'm insisting on that. It's useless unless I can decrypt the data. Oh. What I like. I doubt that will have... Okay. If his... What? If his memory is intact, I'm not... Yeah, well, well said. Um... It's a storage chip with a data port on it, full of some encrypted memory Metromind downloaded from me. Oh, maybe, uh... The decryption module was able to unlock the data chip's memory files. Cool. Now... What is this? 